Some economic good news for European companies and politicians as the latest business surveys revealed elements of a recovery, albeit a rather lopsided one, with Germany steaming ahead and France floundering. But the head of the European Central Bank, Mario Draghi, speaking before the European Parliament, called it fragile, saying the ECB's stimulus measures need more time. Monetary policy, in order to have its effect on prices and output, has to be transmitted and there is a certain amount of time. I often say it takes a while before our monetary policy gets transmitted to the real economy. Other than that, I think we have plenty of instruments to cope with, uh, with deflation. We don't see, as I said, this risk now, but we are certainly very well aware. Draghi was also asked about the loss of his key ally, ECB board member Jörg Asmussen, who's quitting to join Germany's new government. Asmussen has been central to sorting out the Eurozone crisis and the ECB's chief negotiator in creating an EU banking union. His contribution to the work of the executive board and ECB has been invaluable. We, we will feel we'll miss him. We'll miss him a lot. We'll miss him a lot. This woman is a leading candidate to succeed Asmussen. She is Sabine Lautenschläger, the vice president of Germany's central bank, who already has the backing of German finance minister Wolfgang Schäuble.